How's everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. This week, I'm gonna be doing one of my priority designs that I posted on my website, and I am excited, I am so happy, I'm ecstatic because I've been waiting for someone to book this design. So with that being said, let's get this day started. Let's go! So this is the project that I'm gonna be doing this week. Uh, it has color and it has a whole bunch of detail. And I'm gonna be using today uh, the Revolution ink by Nick Hurtado. Uh, definitely wanna give them a try, they look very uh, thick pigment, which that's something I really like. I'm excited, it has a whole bunch of contrast, a whole bunch of highlights, uh, and yeah, everything's perfect about this. So I'm excited and I cannot wait to get this started. This is your first tattoo? Yes. I'm weak. Huh? <laughs> no, it's good, it's good. I just, uh, I didn't know, I thought you had it more. <laughs> I'm glad you're starting off with a good piece. Oh, really? Also, you drove from California? Yeah. Okay. Are you stationed? I'm from Wisconsin. I'm stationed in 29. So oh. Yo, your cab, bro, is my arm. <laughs> Chill, what the hell? <laughs> they say this is the best part of the tattoo and then everything else sucks. Yeah, <laughs> that's a fact right there. <laughs> everything's down here after this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's it. What happened? I said you'd edit my toes out if I didn't have socks on. Oh, probably not. I'll focus on that. <laughs> Who? Zoom, <laughs> Zoom in. Look at that. What is this? How much does this hurt you think? Uh, not much. I think it's very, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Very, uh, Kenny, ¿cómo se dice soportar? Soportable. How do you say soportable in English? Huh? <laughs> Supportable. <laughs> so, <laughs> So, what is it? Manageable. Is manageable? Yeah? Is that a word? Okay, good. Cool. <laughs> manageable. I was trying to, I was about to say it's very affordable, but that shit uh, makes no sense. It makes no sense. I mean, I would understand. Affordable. So, affordable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've been making up words sometimes. Like, it's, it's my favorite thing. Uh, so, we have my client here. It turns out that it is his first tattoo. And which is insane to me. He just came in. I didn't know it was his first tattoo, so that's gonna be super dope. That turns this into a whole different experience. Cause I thought you had tattoos, but you don't. <laughs> so this is gonna be a two-day project. Day one, we're gonna be doing the astronaut here with the score, a whole bunch of color, a whole bunch of details. Second day, I do have already uh, uh, designed already, but I definitely want to see how everything goes and how everything's placed today. That way, I can figure out where I'm gonna put the planet just because he has a huge muscle here on the thigh and that can definitely affect the weight. <laughs> He's just, it's just a muscle <laughs> that's there. Just skip, you shouldn't just skip leg day until you got a tattoo, bro. But um, the thing about this muscle is that it can definitely affect the shape of any circular shape or any square. Because once you put it there, it's gonna seem like it's not straight or it's not perfectly uh, circle. So definitely we gotta move things around to make sure that everything looks perfect. Uh, so yeah, you ready? Nervous, excited, nervous. scared. A little nervous. A little nervous. Yeah, I ain't scared. <laughs> I booked it for a reason, my dude. One thing I do want to do with this area of the skull is I first want to apply my solid black before I even put any color. And the reason why it is because I want to see how dark I can make the skull look before looking way too dark. So first, I'm going to do all my contrast on, on the inside here, on this area, this area. Anything, wherever I see that is solid black, I'm going to apply it. But I'm gonna fade it out with my round liner, uh, which I'm gonna be using my 14 round liner with a voltage of a 5.0.
So as of right now, I'm just applying my brown here. And I really like this color because it doesn't look like burnt brown, you know what I mean? It just looks more like in the reddish kind of side, and which I really, really like. Um, and I'm gonna slowly just do the, my scribble technique where I just do here and there, you know, textures and map it out because I definitely want to layer it with my orange. Definitely like the way this is uh, looking on skin. So as you can see, I'm slowly transitioning into a lighter brown. I just dipped it in my yellow. That way I can get like a brighter orange. So as you can see now my yellow is starting to show a little bit more. Which I really, really like. I want to make this a little bit darker so I'm just going to layer it. I am running my machine of 5.0 uh, voltage with my 14 round liner. With a low voltage like this, it, I can definitely take my time, really look over everything that I'm doing instead of uh, running it at 10. And because if I was running it at 10 for, with my style, I wouldn't be able to do it just because it is way too fast for my hand speed. And uh, that is something that as an artist, you have to figure out uh, sooner than later because knowing your hand speed and being connected to your voltage, it's the key to everything. You know, you're going to be able to do a lot more. And it's kind of hard to say how to find that with you know it's all practice and experience i wish there was a, like a shortcut to it it's just trying new things trying new things is gonna it's gonna help you figure out faster what you're capable of and once you find it explore that and keep going at it until you get really good at it then after that sky's the limit as i get closer here i'm gonna mix my brown with my black dip it once just enough to make it a little bit darker there you go see that and yeah, that's it. I really, really like the way that, that turned out right there. So I'm gonna do it one more time. Oh. There is a highlight around this area, so I'm gonna leave that open too. All right, when with this, I'm gonna continue doing the same thing across the whole entire skull. It's just layering, going back and forth until I get the tone that I really like. Esta noche de travesura. Yeah, exactly. And then I'm gonna branch it out, yeah, to the this top. Are you gonna go behind the knee? Uh, yep. <laughs> you came here to get tatted. Now, nah, you, but you're handling it super good, though. You're good. You'll be able to take it tomorrow. What is it? Because I've just been like. <laughs> <laughs> do what mic. you gotta do, my guy. Just have your breathing, just. <sighs> yep. In the background, a whole separate YouTube video. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Just a video of My you. My client's breathing. <laughs> what do you expect on your first What is it? Uh, ASMR? What is it? Yeah, <laughs> ASMR. ASMR. Yeah. Breathing ASMR. ASMR, there you go. Man, yeah. I hate when that comes out on my TikTok. 
You what? know what I mean? Like, yo, I'm scrolling, and next thing you know, it's somebody live just, yeah, or like I eating. That. I'm like, bro, it I don't want this. Out. And the thing is that if I watch it for half a second, I get nothing but that. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> you gotta scroll not? quick. You gotta scroll quick. Like, you, you cannot think about it. <sighs> How has been your experience so far today? Uh, <laughs> the last, this, oh, down here? Was a breeze. Yeah. And, and then, then up here. Not yeah, a breeze. Not a breeze. <laughs> Definitely not. Down there, I was like on my phone, like, this is whatever. No, I'm do this shit forever. And then, and then you I got, hit you with the skull, huh? Once you started here, yeah. the shade here, I was like, hey, it's starting to hurt a little bit more. I can see it. Yeah. And the skull and the colors, I was like, yeah. You were like, ah, right, this, yeah. uh, this is not good right now. <laughs> <laughs> but you handled it really good, though. You're chilling. Now you're ready for the second day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not ready for more tomorrow. We're ready for more tomorrow. It's a bigger area and <laughs> and the back of the knee. And bit. the back of the knee. All right, this this line right here, these two lines that I'm about to do, they could, they're gonna be a little painful. All, right. All you gotta do is just <sighs> relax. It's gonna be long. Not too long. All right. What? Long enough. No, he was. <laughs> that was the truth, for sure. <laughs> that was the truth. It was the truth. <laughs> All right, second line coming. Oh, that was only one. <laughs> that was one. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, let's hit it. All right. How bad? Got you off guard. I had to. I was like, it's, it's okay. I'm already it's fine. there. Better like that. Might as well. <laughs> I'm here. Already then, lay down. Wasabi, wasa. What's up, man? I'm, not, I'm less nervous, but. You're less nervous today? Because I know it's going to hurt bad. <laughs> <laughs> Before I was like, I didn't really know how much yeah. it was going to hurt. And I was like, I didn't really know what I was getting myself into. <laughs> now I'm like, yeah, that's just going to hurt bad. <laughs> but it's OK. But it's OK. How'd you sleep? <laughs> I think I woke up at like 4. It took what? me a little while to fall asleep. And I don't think I moved around very much either. Oh, okay. So and then, you cleaned it up really good though. I'm glad. Yeah, it wasn't bleeding at all. There's no plasma, oh, really? nothing. Nothing. Perfect. <laughs> God damn, fool. That's like a, a bump. Huh? That's like a bump right on, here. Right? <laughs> what is that? What? <laughs> the original idea was to put the planet here on the bottom and then have the meteors on the top. But instead, I'm gonna switch that around because if I was to put that planet right here, this um, this area here is gonna make the, the planet look like it's not a circle anymore. So you definitely don't want that. And it's all about placement, you know? So that is why I'm, I ended up switching it up. Okay, let me see. Yep, that's the one. Perfect. Ah, uh, dale mambo. Now we got the meteors down here. Oh, those are gonna hurt. <laughs> that shit's gonna hurt. Damn. Yup. Sick, perfect. All right, relax, uh, turn towards, uh, turn. yeah, there you go, perfect, thank you. I like it. Yeah, that meteor on right here is gonna be fucking insane. Honestly, I'm looking forward to that meteor yeah, right there. Yeah, that shit is gonna. Uh, and it's the beginning of the stencil. Right on the too. knee, and then like. So we already got the stencil on. Uh, what I did, I ended up placing the meteors here on the bottom. The meteor is gonna move with the body. It's, gonna, it's a great placement, which I really, really like. You gotta think about those things, because if you place something uh, with the shape or with the face or something like a portrait on this area, once they sit, that is gonna change the features of everything, you know? So you gotta think about what to place on this area so whenever they say or they stand up, they lay down, they do any activity, 
this area is, gonna look, is still gonna look amazing. So that's the reason why I ended up putting it here. And the colors that I'm gonna be putting on this piece is same colors as the skull to make it match. We have the orange, we have the yellow, we have the, the bright uh, white highlights and making sure that it stands out like fire. <laughs> I hope I'm not scaring you with this, with the explaining this. <laughs> He's we like, well, what are. else are you going to do? <laughs> and lastly, uh, <laughs> and the other thing that I'm going to be doing is for the background, I'm going to be mixing my black, my gray and royal blue to give it more of the depth, the dimension, you know, make it look like there's nebulas all over the place, shooting stars, a whole bunch of stars and yeah. <sighs> We're solid. Let's get it. <laughs>
Yeah. That's, uh, that's burning. That's why I left it at the end, my guy. <laughs> that way you had no choice but to take it because it is the last five minutes. <laughs> Motivation. Oh. Not bad. After the 18 hours of you taking ink, this is the first time you make a noise. <laughs> like a real noise, you know what I mean? Yeah. That one, was, that one was sharp. Yeah. That one was sharp. A little spicy. It's a wrap. That's it? It's a wrap. That's it. <laughs>